Hello, welcome back to another gas walkthrough. Today we're looking at uh, 7th of April uh, 2024's Different Neighbors by Clover. Um, Clover's one of our setters here at Gas HQ, so am I. My name is Bill Murphy. Uh, Philip Newman is also around. Um, don't get him started or he will uh, talk to you about classic Sudoku. Um, our janitor once did that and, uh, you know, we had to let him go because he didn't do anything for eight straight hours. Uh, the janitor, not Philip. Um, so, uh, we here at Gas HQ create genuinely approachable variant Sudoku. Um, they are a little different to your regular classic Sudoku, although surprise, surprise, you might have a couple of those coming up tonight. Um, but you can find the link to this puzzle below where you can solve it yourself. Um, and then with that, you can, I guess, uh, blah, 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 blah. Um, sorry, I just got an email notification. Um, you can uh, see how fast you can do this. Two hats is a fantastic time. One hat pretty good time um everyone gets done so because we love you all very very much with that let's get into it uh so this is different neighbors sudoku so um each uh, uh four normal sudoku rules apply each box row and column must contain the digits one to nine once each now we have four circled digits in the grid um, and for these circle digits, this tells you how many different numbers are in that grid. Not how many times they appear because, well, that's a three. So that would have to appear, you know, uh, not nine, eight and seven couldn't appear three times in each cell. But this three tells us that only seven, nine and eight can appear around it. Cool. Good. Great. Got it sick all right give it a go if you feel so inclined but uh otherwise i'm going to jump into it now like i said um seven eight and nine can only appear in these uh cells so let's do that uh this cell sees seven uh sees eight and nine so it must be seven uh this cell sees uh seven and nine so it must be eight this cell now sees 7, 8, so it must be 9, meaning this is 8 and this is 7. Likewise, we can do the same trick down here. This sees 8 and 9, making it 7. This sees 7 and 8, making it 9. This is 8, meaning this is 9 and this is 7. Now, let's have a look at this box. Now, this cell sees 1 and 7, so it must be 4. This cell sees 4 and 7, so it must be 1. So this is 7. Now we got to uh, we've got to put three, five, and six here, but this cell uh, means that these cells can now only contain one, four, five, and six. Likewise, up here, this four means that these cells can only contain one, two, three, and six. Now I will do some uh, Sudoku to try and fill that one out. Um, uh, so, uh, two. And we got a one and a nine there. Um, this is uh, two, three, and six, all of which are fine here, except six, two, and three. Uh, one, five, and uh, four, five, and eight to place. Yeah, four, five, and eight. Um, this thing's a one, four, and a five. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Uh, this one sees one, two, three, and six. So, uh, one, two, and three. So it must be six. This sees one, three, and six. So that must be two. Uh, one, four, five, and six to place here. But these see four and six. Uh, this cell sees five down here. So this is one and that's five. All right. Now that's all the variant Sudoku done. So let's do some classic Sudoku. Um, ba -ba -ba. Am I missing something there? Probably. Um, I've been stuck in meetings all day. All right. Uh, what does this need? This needs six, eight, and two. No, I can't quite do that one yet. One, five, and eight. Nah. Uh, no, that was one, four, and five. This is one, five, and eight. Still no. Um, two there. Oh, okay. That's what I'm missing. Um, 
five and four because we got a five down here. Uh, this is six, three, and eight. So we'll put a three there and six and eight there. Uh, four and two, four in box seven tells us which way around this goes. Uh, three, four, and six. Oh, this cell sees four and six. Bang. Love to see it. I love this for me. All right. Uh, one, four, and five to place. This is, no. Uh, well, we're definitely putting a four there. Um, this needs a one and a nine, but I can't quite do that just yet. Uh, one and five in row two, the one down in row nine tells us where, uh, column nine tells us which way around this goes. Uh, then we can unwind this. Uh, nine and two in column three, mean that two and nine, seven and eight, six and eight, two, five, six, and one to go here. So this is six. Can't quite do the one and the five yet, but nearly four, five, eight. There we go. One and five. And unbelievably, the classic has actually taken me just as long as the variant has today. Um, five and one. And this has been Different Neighbors Sudoku by Clover. Um, I've been Bill Murphy, like normal. Uh, you know, wherever wherever you are in the world, I hope you have a wonderful day, wonderful afternoon, wonderful evening. Whatever, you know, takes your fancy. And uh, yeah, I will catch you next time. Cheers.